So if you could travel back in time, mm -hmm. meet your 25 year old self, that turmoil, mm -hmm. those experiences, uh, the disturbing time and yeah, the yeah. war and everything. And, and now as you are, uh, if, you, if you had like two to three minutes with that person who is 20 year old yourself, mm -hmm. what would you say to him? I would basically start with asking, you know, say, well, have a look at how you are relating to yourself, you know, and are you making enough room for yourself or right. are you doing what everybody else is doing, trying to figure out out there mm -hmm. what you have to do in order to be, um, you know, successful right. in order, order to have status and things like this and be wealthy. You know, I would say, you know, to, to really try to find out who you are, you know, that this is... Uh, yeah. Don't you know, worry about status and yeah. success, but find out who you are. Don't worry about it, because it's important too, you know, yes. but basically, you know, try to figure out who you are, because, I mean, it's much more difficult to figure out, you know, what they want and trying to be that, you know, than to try to figure out who you are. So, if I know who I am, then I can approach my work life or my professional life and I can say this this is what would be good for me this would make sense for me this is what I would be good at and useful at okay mm -hmm. and I would be able to do that and not try to spend half my life figuring out you know what people like and what they want mm -hmm. and then trying to emulate that and you know it's not me right. you know, I just missed me and I find I, yourself yeah yeah find yourself who you are and yeah. focus on that 